The government, through the Ministry of Agriculture, has been distributing free of charge early maturing traditional crop seeds to farmers in drought prone areas in an attempt to improve the food supply situation. The program, which has been running for the last two years, was intended to curb incidents of hunger and famine that have become characteristic during periods of dry weather. But it seems farmers are now partly at fault for the perennial food shortages. When we supplied this seed, some of the farmers tried you know, to use them as food to cook or even make something like mothokoi. The habit, which has become rampant to the seasonal distribution of free seeds for planting of traditional food crops such as millet, sorghum and cowpeas, perhaps points to a bigger issue, that of starving farmers feasting on the very seeds they are meant to plant to provide the nation with sufficient food. Although the government has put in place various initiatives to boost food supply, lack of adequate funding has hampered efforts to purchase and provide storage for the surplus produce. If we have to uh, store the total SGR that we want, uh, that is about uh, 8 million bucks, you can imagine we need about 12 billion shillings. In spite of this, the government maintains it is still stocking up on supplies to see the country through the predicted La Nina dry weather to avoid a spike in commodity prices.